welcome to Lynn's Recipes. Tonight I'm making some crostini to go with our shrimp and corn chowder. To make this, you will need the following. You'll need a loaf of French bread, a quarter cup of olive oil, a half a stick of butter, two cloves of garlic that I'm going to press in my garlic press, and you'll need some grated Parmesan cheese, and I have a block of Parmesan that I just used my hand grater to grate. So the first thing I'm going to do is slice my bread. And I'm going to do it on a diagonal with a bread knife. Okay, I'm going to lay this on my baking pan. I've also preheated my oven to 350 degrees. together. So the first thing I'm going to do is put my butter in the pan along with my olive oil and then I'm going to press my garlic into the butter and olive oil. This is the kind of press that you can just press it with the peel on and the garlic will comes out like that. You don't have to bother with the peeling of it. Now the second one. So now what I'm going to do is take it over to the stove and let this all mix together and the butter melt. So I'm just melting my butter into my olive oil with my garlic. And this is what we're going to do to brush on the bread. Our butter garlic mixture is done. So now what I'm going to do is go back and brush it on the bread. Okay, so I've got a little brush here. I'm just going to brush all the pieces liberally with the butter and the olive oil and the garlic. I finished brushing the topping on my bread. I sprinkled it liberally with my Parmesan cheese, and now I'm putting it in a 350 degree preheated oven for 8 to 10 minutes. So our bread is done, and we actually did bake it at 350 for 8 minutes, and we put it under the broiler for a few minutes. So now I'm going to put it on the tray and show it to you. our crostini. We're going to have this with our shrimp corn chowder tonight. I hope you enjoy it.